Howdy doody everybody, my name is Kev Gooey and welcome back to Nico Para. In the last episode, apparently I have a sweet scent coming off of me. And then I was saying this, it was almost as if... If what? Oh. Where did Vanilla go? Where'd she come from? Oh yeah, she went to buy drinks. I just remembered. Uh, well, what happened? Wah! What? What? What do you mean? Unfounded suspicion? I've never heard of that before. You, you two surprised me too. What? No, I wasn't. Wait, weren't you the one that said you wanted to go get drinks anyways? I wasn't doing anything other than rubbing Chocolate's head like always. Wait, my scent is different? ちょこらと御主人の間に私は座ろうと思う。開けて。あ、あ、オッケー。開けてくれないなら実力行使。そのまま座る。あ、オッケー。うう。You're well, hold on, it's not a competition. I didn't let her sit there. Two blessings at once? Before that, you two do know about the concept of public morals in society, right? In any case, please get off my lap. Seriously, now. Hmm. Aww. Oh man. Before I knew it, Chakala was her old self again. Oh, okay, that's good then. Well, as long as she's happy, there's nothing to worry about. But... In the end, my break time ended up not feeling like a break at all. Well, yeah, it did. It does right now because they're breaking my legs. Because apparently they are heavy. And was completely spent with the two of them. Aww. Ah, the racing in my heart won't slow down. Hmm, racing in her heart. Oh. <gasps> she falling for me. Chocolate, uh, okay? What's she doing? All right. Get that invoice. Ooh, tomorrow's order. What is it? Big wedding cake. Sounds good. I'll take a look at it later. Hmm, use your place? Uh, what are you staring at? Chocolate? Uh, what are you doing? Mm-hmm. Um, Chakla-san? You're hugging me. Uh, Meow, what's up? Isn't the answer I'm looking for.
Uh, are you okay, Chakra? I don't know, I was asking you that. What? I, I don't think I could force you on my back. Hold up, hold up. Clearly, you stuck yourself onto me, Chakla. Yeah. Exactly that. Hmm. But you did. Puzzled, she frantically tilted her head left and right. Is she sick with some terrible disease? This just started happening mere seconds ago, though. Are you alright? You've been kind of out of it since we got back from our break. Oh, okay. But that doesn't really... Uh, uh, doesn't really have a connection there, but okay. Hi. Uh, well, if she says she's fine, then I guess there's nothing wrong. It didn't seem like she was making any particular mistakes while working either. I'll think about things after observing her a bit more. I thought about that as I watched her head back. Hmm?大丈夫?いや、大丈夫。いや、うん。今日はちょっと暑いにゃってだけだから。Hot? Did I turn up the AC? Hmm. Oh, oh no, that's not good. Oh, uh, again? Okay. Uh, okay. Oh, Chakla, what's wrong? Yes? Uh, what? You forgot. There's like 10 steps into the kitchen. You're telling me. Chakla spaced out as she tilted her head in confusion again. It didn't seem like she was doing it on purpose. I wonder what's gone into her. Hmm, I'm wearing the same thing. It was clear that she wasn't herself. Somehow, she looks a bit flushed too. Oh, hmm. I'm just going to feel your forehead here, okay? I touched her small forehead. Her body shivered with a twitch. I could feel Chakla shivering slightly through the palm of my hand. It didn't particularly seem like she had a fever or anything. Oh, that's good. Hmm? Huh? Chakla? Oh, now she's, uh, hugging me from the front? Wait, Chakala? Uh, hey! <laughs> she cooed in a sweet voice I hadn't heard before. Still clinging to me, she rubbed her cheek against mine. Oh. Oh my. It was clear that she wasn't feeling like herself. Yeah, 
definitely. Her voice was especially sugary sweet. You could even say that there was a stickiness to it. What? A stickiness? Her grip on my back tightened. I could feel a certain degree of sensuality in her actions. Uh, it's okay. Um, uh, yeah? She suddenly came to her senses and let go of me. She flailed her arms about as she howled in confusion. Where'd you come from? Oh, so it's about the milk well. Oh, okay. Hmm. Yes? Hey, Vanilla, do you know what's with Chocola? He's acting weird today, right? Oh, so you have noticed. A breakthrough. This felt promising. By the way, I've been curious, but... Do I smell strange or something? Oh. Okay. Right? It was somewhat relieving to hear that I smell normal. Well, it meant that I didn't smell especially sweet or anything. Huh? Could it be what? Hmm? Vanilla was drawn in by what I had said. It seemed as if she realized something. Either way, can you tell Chocolate to go up to her room to rest? Oh. Can you handle it? It's starting to calm down out there, so I'll take care of things afterwards. Oh, okay. That works too. Uh, are you sure? But that, that... What? That doesn't really show why you're acting weird. <laughs> I like Vanilla, she's funny. Oh, oh. Wow, she did capture her. <laughs> hmm. Let's see, we needed some more Milafuel, right? Surprisingly, Vanilla was a type who could rise to a challenge when necessary, which is good. I stood in front of the wide open refrigerator, and despite the distance, I could still hear the voices of my poster cat girls right behind me. Huh. Meow, meow. Force clothing changing mode activated. <laughs> and I'm going to end the episode here, everybody. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you guys did, then please slime that like button and help support me by sharing this video and by subscribing down below. In the next episode, we will find out uh, why chocolate is acting weird so everyone thank you for watching this episode and you will hear me in the next one goodbye